Okay, since I just happen to have a shifter sitting in front of me, don't ask me why, um, let me show you real quick how our reverse lockout works. So, here on the shifter, let's see if I can bring this uh, a little brighter. There is a tab right there. Now, when you pull up, you pull up the tab. This tab creates it, if you possible, hold on, this way. So that when you twist it, hold on, I'm not sure if I can do this with both hands. Uh, anyway, you get the idea. That hits that. And when you get it into reverse by lifting, you can go in reverse. And when you come down again, it clicks over but it should be impossible. Now if you're having a hard time, what might be happening is if your knob is not letting the reverse go all the way, like if it stopped halfway, and then you have to kind of force this piece of plastic over the lip, where if it was just barely rubbing, I could see it being a little difficult, where you have to kind of shove it instead of clearing the full distance. So. That's how it works. It's just a plastic wall with a plastic tab. And when you pull on it, it goes up. Alright.